What is going on everybody? T-Bone coming back at you again with another Yu-Gi-Oh! unboxing. So it was at the local Walmart and they actually had some packs. We have some Brothers of Legend. They also had Bursa Destiny. Um, I'd rather try my luck at some Brothers. And they actually had one limited holiday mystery power box. I'm hoping to get the Zombie Horde, but I think this only came fully sealed and I don't feel it. It feels like a loose deck. But I guess we'll see what we have anyway. Uh, before we head into this, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe, notification bell, all that good YouTube stuff. Help build the channel grow so I can continue bringing more amazing videos like this. So let's start off with the mystery power box first. And let's see what we can get out of this. Hopefully some really good stuff. Also, this is the first video I'm shooting with a new lighting and a new mic. So hopefully it looks good, it sounds good, and all that jazz. So let's see, it is a loose deck, and what do we have? We have uh, the Nordic deck from the Legendary Hero decks. Ooh, that's kind of low, but still not misprint category. It's still, yeah, it's still within the text box, unfortunately. But I mean, this right here, this sealed deck by itself, um, this is probably about $20. So that's actually not too bad. That's why you if you're not into sealed product, you should. And if I'm not mistaken, we probably should be getting, I think, three fists of the gadgets, which is really unfortunate. Yep, so there's one, three fists of the gadgets. We got Maximum Crisis. Code of the Duel's first ad, it's a Euro pack. And Dark Crisis. All right. So we actually got a first at Code of the Duelist. Uh, that'd be cool if we could pull a Firewall Dragon. Uh, these, I believe, are Euro print also. Ooh, yes. So these are Euro print. You can always tell because it'll say United Kingdom. Um, another easy way to tell is US packs will look like that. Euro packs will look like this. It's another very easy way to tell. But Fists of the Gadgets, um, yikes, but I kind of expected them going into this. Not very thrilled about these, but let's see what we can get. Yeah, you can see how the Euro print is a nice deeper color. Let's see, yellow gadget, red gadget, starving venom fusion dragon, actually definitely not bad. Talkback Lancer, and uh, Brotherhood of the Fire Fist Elephant. Actually, I think this is one of the better secrets to get from the set. So that's actually not terrible to start off, especially with a set that was pretty lackluster in my opinion. See fire formation Yoko. Actually, you know what? Let's separate the foil the secrets from this. Prohibit Snake. And Archfiend's Manifestation. And last one of Fist of the Gadgets. Uh, what do we what can we ask for? Code radiator is a good one, actually. Um there was another Fire Fist. I think it was Panda, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, these Euro print cards just feel so nice. I don't know. They feel different. And we got Fire Formation Dome as our secret. So actually, Elephant's not terrible to pull, to pull out of that. Um... Yeah, I think Maximum Crisis had better cards. But now we have Euro, Code of the Duels, First Ed. Let's see. Okay, it is rare than foil. Uh, DDD, Gust, High King Alexander. And unfortunately, just a super cracking dragon. So nothing great out of that, unfortunately. Maximum Crisis. 
Can we get an ash out of this? Oh man, that would be... That would be some pack. Be some mystery box, honestly. And unfortunately... Wow, I thought it was rarer than super. Fortunately, it's only Sylvan Princess Sprite. Not even a very good super to get, honestly. And Magician's Restage is our rare. Dark Crisis. Let's see what we can get out of this. Hopefully we can get a foil. Let's see. Acrobat Monkey, very cool. I don't think we have a foil. DD Trainer. Yet we don't have one. Uh, Guardian Trice is our rare. Final Countdown, actually not bad common. It's a pull. So that is our mystery power box. Um, it was all right. Uh, definitely, it's, it wasn't great, but it could have honestly been a lot worse. So I'm just going to hopefully redeem ourselves here with some Brothers of Legend. And I should have taken these all out of the packs blisters before, but it's only a few. And yes, there were still packs left. I did not take all of them. Um, I do believe everyone should have a fair shot. And honestly, brothers, its value is not really there. So I'm going to see how hard I can neg on this set right now out of these five packs. At this point, hoping for some misprints. Uh, Droplet is still good. Um, obviously, Astral, Leviathan, uh, Dragoon. You know, but unfortunately, there's really not much left. And these cards have tacoed pretty bad. Infernoid Tierra kind of got me a little nervous. Because I saw Fusion and I was like, did we really? But then I remembered it's a Starlight. Wow, the Supers in this one were just not good. And Double Exposure. Yeah, seeing money just fly down the drain right now. Not very good. And Ultraguys Pukery. Uh, not really that great. I mean, it's a cool card, but man, these are really bad. Uh, yeah, we're not seeing any of the big hit cards here. Like, we need some really good chase cards, and we are not getting them. Kareeborn. Fossil Dig. ZS Utopic Sage. Again, really nothing crazy. But, last pack. This is the one that has Dragoon in it, right? Like, this is it. Altar Utopia. Ah, Godarla's not terrible. Yeah, these are really bad. And our final secret, Stealth Kragen Spawn. Unfortunately, nothing too, too crazy. Um, yeah, just thought I'd do a quick, quick er video on just some random things that we found at Walmart. But yeah, fortunately nothing too, too exciting, so I apologize for that. But that's what happens. You win some, you lose some. 
Anyway, hopefully you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, make sure you hit that like button down below. Subscribe if you're new. Comment down below. Uh, hit the notification bell. You know, all that good YouTube stuff. Again, help build the channel grow so I can keep buying packs to open for you guys and see what, you know, see our luck. But that's going to do it for this one. So until next time, I will see you guys later.